Понял, под моим управлением. Наблюдаю у вас 292 на 90. Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have a very different video. Uh, just showing a showcase on a mod uh, that I, I'm enjoying um, actually flying. So let me test you to you guys. Uh, make sure to see the, the, the electronic panel here. Let's see. Electronic, electric power switch. And we have basically a Flaming Cliffs cockpit working, uh, which is pretty nice, pretty nice. Uh, let's turn on one of the engines over here, of the MiG-29. Of course, we are in the MiG-29 um, on the Iranian Air Force, and we're going to intercept... It's loading the texture yet, but uh, we are going to intercept two Mirages uh, 2000s uh, coming from the United Emirates, Arab Emirates, or something like that. Uh, but yeah. Let's close the cockpit. Lower our flaps. One here. Uh, let's turn on the taxi lights, the navigation lights, and the panel lights a little bit. Um, yeah, we're going to just go for the route mode for now. And we can even change the color. It kind of bugs it out a little bit, but you can change the color. Let's go for ah, for BVR. Uh, one engine is started. Uh, let's start the other one. Engine start. Okay. And yeah, basically it is a moddable uh, Flaming Cliffs. It's a mod that makes some of the cockpits on Flaming Cliffs a little bit clickable. They are not fully clickable. Uh, because of course Flaming Cliffs doesn't have all the little systems that a normal uh, full fidelity mod uh, will have. Uh, but the main things that you always need are always uh, are all here basically. So uh, as you see the electrical panel, engine starts, lights and stuff, weapon systems, you know, raiders, uh, anything that you want to use in a general manner in the Flaming Cliffs you can actually use it. I cannot wait for them to actually do more of these type of mods, uh, but they are using the MiG-29, Sukhoi 27-33, 25T and the J-11. I'm going to leave it in the description. Uh, basically uh, where to, to, to download and stuff. So yeah, pretty cool, right? And especially the MiG-29, which is my f one of my favorite aircraft in the in DCS. The um, it's just uh, basically a, a preview of things to come, you know. Uh, they kind of confirmed that uh, MiG-29A will be coming for a full fidelity mod and I cannot wait to see that but it, it will take a lot of time so and until we receive the Air Force E for example that I'm going to buy and the MiG-23 MLA uh, this is one of the coolest things that you can do with 70s to 80s aircraft you know uh, I still have other mods but uh, of course the MiG-29 is always amazing let's trim the aircraft a little bit Let's intercept those targets. So let's go landing light on because we are on the runway. And full afterburners. Aircraft likes to do a little bit of the does a little bit of this sometimes. Yeah, we are fast enough. As you see, gear up and lights off let's turn off our navigation lights as well over here uh, of course the flaps let's bring our flaps up let's turn off the, the mirrors uh, let's turn on our radar down there and you can also turn on your electrical optical system as you see but yeah radar on And we are airborne. Let's try to intercept those targets. One, one. In field. One, one. Request bogey dope. One eight nine. So let's intercept them and destroy the targets. Of course, all the other systems like target designation and stuff like that are the same, but uh, there are some cool stuff like. Let me remember where it was. Yeah, they're locking me up. But we're fine. Uh, I th yeah, 
here we can see the frequency of the there you know so pretty pretty interesting let's turn on TWS And let's try to fire one of the R-27s as soon as possible. So make one of them go... Um, we're going to maintain the tanks for now. So radar is locked. Fox 1. Gonna crank a little bit. He's going defensive I think. Flash one, okay. Where's the other one? It's right here somewhere. Let's try to intercept the other one. Fox one as well. Let's go for a crank. He lost the lock with me. Try to maintain maintain him on the on the on the target on the radar uh, let's see I think the missile will hit but let's check maybe not yeah maybe not uh, let's get a uh, target designator yeah eight kilometers Fox 2 he's flaring out maybe my missile will miss let's see yeah, I missed Maybe this close he won't. Yeah, he didn't see me the missile coming. Yeah, splash another one. Is he dead? I don't think he's dead. But as you see, flares are pretty... <laughs> pretty easy to decoy a, a missile like the R60M still, just like in War Thunder. Come on, Mick. This is so slow that it's really hard to actually maintain it. But it's just a showcase on, on the mod itself. As you see, it's pretty reliable to use. Uh, of course, uh, let's see. The clouds are a little bit hard, but no, too close. Yeah, that was a bad, poor shot. I think he's going down anyway. Yeah, my other MiG is there. Calm down, man. He's trying to attack me. Look at that. He's so slow that I always overshoot. Let's try to outturn him. Not the most amazing dogfight ever. But he's just turning a lot. Come on, mate. <laughs> the guy just doesn't give up. Look at that. Of course, I'm using the helmet mounted thing. I, I going, um, basically use... Uh, he crashed. Okay. But I basically use the, the systems to actually... Um, the hotkeys to do, but you can do by here, you know. Uh, BVR, the vertical scan, optical scan helmet mounted as you see so pretty cool it's in this little thing over here uh, let's go for in route let's turn off the radar and the thing uh, let's try to actually let's see where is it this is emergency jetson you are supposed to it's kind of glitchy sometimes some of the buttons uh, still but uh, pretty cool in general let's try to divert to our uh, our waypoint I think it's waypoint like 5 or something 4? maybe it's too far 4 of 1, yeah I think it is or maybe not uh, let's see if it Yeah, 
think it's right there somewhere but you can do also there was a mode that you can actually do some kind of stuff but as you see here you can turn the brightness on and off but uh, it's a little bit finicky as you see it turns other stuff uh, let's return Uh, but yeah, pretty cool, right? Pretty cool. Um, let me check if I can actually jetson the <laughs> the fuel tank. I really don't know. Here's the chute deployment. My craft is just being a pain the ass to fly with the trim like that. So yeah, here we go. Uh, let's see if I can find... This is the weapon jettison, so there's probably somewhere to... It's funny because you kind of don't have manuals to do this, you just have to find it out by yourself, because, you know... <laughs> uh, but... I mean... It's supposed to be near, near the airfield. Uh, you can also use the, the autopilot, as you see, auto hold, for example, and it will hold it in autopilot. Kind of weird sometimes, but it, it is a problem with the autopilot. Uh, let's see, um, it's shaking a little bit. Our radar is ECM. I mean, the aircraft doesn't have ECM, but. Ah, fuel tank jetson, down here. See? So I'm going to click it out. And as you see, the fuel tank dropped. It's behind the, the power thing. Uh, let's turn off the the autopilot. Uh, where is it? Uh, right there. Okay. Let's tell him to actually maintain hold position. Flight anchor here. What's happening? Oh, sure. Jeez. Uh, but yeah, let's try to land this baby but yeah pretty cool uh, to see it kind of gives a, a I mean an extra life to flaming cliff aircraft I mean it's the same but has l a little spice to it so pretty cool Let's configure Gear everything. down. Gear down. Gear I know, down. I know, I know, I know. Flaps are down. And a little bit of a trim. Not the best approach ever, but... Kind of a rough landing as well. <laughs> but, yeah. Click the button, but you can also click uh, in here to deploy the chute uh, on the left side. But yeah, let's try to taxi. Let's taxi to this side. Slow down a little bit. Turn off. The, uh, turn on the taxi lights. Enfield one one. Enfield one one. Mm -hmm. take off. I did not mean to actually click that. Let's turn here. And let's break the aircraft. Let's turn off the, the, the aircraft. So flaps are up. Takes light off. This is off. Um, everything else is just normal, you know. Uh, then you go here. Engine stop. And left engine stop. And then electric power switch off. So everything is turned it off. Okay, so yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I'm going to actually just show on the last part of the video on where you have to install the the mod. Uh, but yeah, you can download it uh, in the description. I will leave the link. Okay.
and of course uh, let's show where to install it uh, you go to users uh, of course uh, your user Matog for example uh, save it games you go for DCS and you go for uh, mods tech and then clickable cockpit this is the, uh, the the file that you have to put in here okay so yeah pretty cool to have that and pretty easy to install as well uh, I'm going to leave the the link for the discard and the link for the download uh, of the mod as well uh, make sure to uh, always leave the support for those guys they're pretty amazing uh, remember the Sukhoi 27 33 J11 Su 25T I'm waiting for the Su 25A which will be amazing uh, the MiG 29A and S of course so yeah see you guys in the next one make sure to subscribe and bye guys see ya